Hey guys, welcome to my video about the Maleficent Hero event for Mega Man X Dive. First things first, you're going to see me select Mega Man Volnut Alt and Howling Storm and Triangular Saber. Um, the Howling Storm and Mega Man Volnut Alt, those will give you bonus points. And Triangular Saber is so that you can slash through boxes and vending machines more easily. And I'm going to let you guys watch the story really quick. Feel free to skip this part. Okay, so the stage is going to load up. Uh, first thing you're going to do is not drop down that first pit. There's nothing down there. Don't do it. Uh, go to the sub ruins that you'll see in front of you. And you should uh, get some cash money and a briefcase. And you can immediately exit out right after. Um, there's going to be boxes right after the sub ruins. Go ahead and slash those up. Um, you can jump down the second pit. There are going to be um, items down there and a few vending machines. And behind the vending machines, you are going to find a secret entrance. And you'll see there's two briefcases and one item. And I'm not sure why this is bugged for me, but for some reason it's playing the Street Fighter, um, the Ryu stage. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, go ahead and jump on top of the boxes. You're going to go up top. Um, so make sure you don't destroy those boxes preemptively. I'm pretty sure you can just ju double jump back up there if you do. But just in case, don't destroy the boxes. And yeah, you can destroy the cars, the bins. That's all good. You can destroy the boxes. Don't destroy these vending machines right here. And you'll be able to jump up top, jump across onto the next platform. Then um, you're going to have to go back, jump on them again, and there are more things to the left up top with briefcase and a few boxes. And then after that's done, you can go ahead and kill the vending machines. Unfortunately, I forgot one up there. I had to jump back up there. And this car doesn't need anything, or you don't need the car for anything, so you just kill that one. And then next part, you're gonna jump down and to the left, and you will land by a sub ruins. A lot of this stage is pretty straightforward. 
Um, the only thing that you're probably going to have to worry about is the very last part, which is um, something we'll get into in a bit here. Okay, we're going to jump back up. As you can see, I'm using Triangular Saber pretty much the whole time. I never really need to bring out my Howling Storm. There's going to be a truck at the very end that you need to shoot. Um, which you will see. It, it will... I get a little too close, and <laughs> I, I didn't think it would activate, but it does. I get, my, get out my Howling Storm, and it gives you money every time you hit it. But I didn't hit it enough. Normally, it would give you a bunch of briefcases if you hit it enough. But as you can see, I only got, like, two bundles of cash. Um, but I did jump down into the left because there's a secret entrance. Um, I was hoping I would get a full 100% off this, but unfortunately, if you miss that truck, if you miss a whole bunch of things from that truck, you won't get 100%, and um, the max notoriety is 100%, so I think you want to get at least one briefcase from that truck in order to get a full 100%. But as you can see, I get so close to 99.7. It's really disappointing. But um, you do get uh, quite a bit from the truck. So if you miss it, um, hopefully there's a chance you got a briefcase from it and you'll get 100%. But as you can see, there's, for the most part, enough. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will leave you guys with the ending of the story. Hehehe! <laughs> Sugoi! Setsume, mo ichido kiku?